Hi everybody, it's Miss Marletta. I'm here on Thursday doing the morning meeting using the Frog Street curriculum. And today think about how you feel. Are you angry? Are you scared? Are you frustrated? Are you anxious? Are you happy? Are you calm? Well, think about how you feel and say, I'm going to be okay. And let's take three deep breaths and relax so we can start our morning. In through your nose, out through your mouth three times. And the last one, let's make it longer. Are you ready? We're going to do our bunny ears. Ready? I feel so much more relaxed and I'm ready to start my day. Now we're going to do our wish her well. And when we do our wish her well, I have the song from Becky Bailey. I'm going to sing for the we wish you well. So you can sing along with it. It's, you know, our song already and you could do the motions. Are you ready? Can you hear it? Let me turn it up. Let me start over because I think it was a little quiet. I wasn't sure if you could hear it. So let me start. Everybody's there? I wish you well on your home days. And oh, the next song started. I had to turn it off because it was starting. If you don't shut it off, it just keeps playing. So today is Thursday, like I said. And it is partly cloudy. So it's still April. And it is uh, 23rd. Now, if you can't count to 100, you can keep practicing counting to 100. If you can count to 100, then you need to work on your adding and subtracting. Well, everybody can work on adding and subtracting. Okay? So, the 23rd. What comes after the 23rd? The 24th. After 23 is 24. Yep. What comes before the 23rd before 23 is 22. So the 22nd is before the 23rd. So today is the 23rd, tomorrow's the 24th, and yesterday was the 22nd. So now remember, we all have to stay safe. And I have all your names inside. So get ready to say that you're going to be safe. Pretend like you have your name. Ready? I am going to be safe. Aw, I'm going to be safe at my house and you're going to be safe at your house. But you have to do, you have to make the right choice to be safe at your house. So remember what choice that you're going to make to be safe at your house. What choice are you going to make to be safe? Okay, so you've got to work on that today. Now, today's Thursday. Who is Miss Marletta, Miss F, and Miss Jenny going to meet with today? Who? Let's see. Are you ready? I'm going to put it back over there because we still have names for Friday. Okay. Today is Thursday. Thursday from 1.30 to 1.45 is Joelle. 
And then today is from 1.15 to 1.30 is Joanna. You guys know all these names. Today from 1.45 to 2 o'clock is Carly. And Lely is today from 2 to 2.15. 2 I can't wait to visit with you on our online classroom and doing our hello in our meet. And this week, we're going to finish up our chart of our fiction and nonfiction. That's what we're going to do in our small group when we meet fiction and nonfiction. So that's really cool. So let's go over to our sentence. And it is, let's sound this out. S says, P says, I says, D says, ER, ER. Okay. Spa, spa, I, der. Spa, I, der. Spider, you're reading, spider. Okay, we do this word all the time. Do you remember what it is? Ba, e, b, g, ins. B, gins. Begins. Spider begins with, with, s in our period and see every time i have a sentence i have spaces in between my words so i know which words are are next so make sure i know i talked to you already about this but make sure you do our can you move with me edie's backyard and schubert and oops over there is sydney so i read these three books but this one is is posted down there and I know you like that from the classroom. Ms. Marlene didn't read it, but someone else did, and it's going to be a lot of fun anyway. So now we have our magnetic story, the Itsy Bitsy Spider. So can you guys sing with me the Itsy Bitsy Spider? Ready? The Itsy Bitsy Spider crawled up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. <gasps> out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider crawled up the spout again. <gasps> that was fun. Do it with your fingers now. Ready? Remember we do it like this. We have it like this, and we'll turn this one over. There we go. The itsy witsy spider crawled up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider crawled up the spout again. Yeah. So you could sing that at home and do the spider at home. And you can probably, well, you're at home now. So you can continue to do it at home. So remember, spider begins with s, s. Spider. And what other sounds do you hear in spider? Spider. Do you remember? Let's look. Spider, S-P-I-D-E-R, spider. You are learning how to read. Pretty soon you're going to be reading your own books all by yourself. All these sentences that you're copying for your homework, you're going to be able to read those soon. So when you copy those sentences, see if there's words that you can sound out. I bet you can. You guys are so, so smart. I bet you can sound out some words. Just like you label all your pictures because you know what the beginning sounds are. You know that already. So remember, when you make your letters, practice 
up high, down low, and on somebody's back. I can't do it on my own back, but you can do it on somebody's back at your house. Make the S for S. Make the W for W. And make the J for J. Thank you. I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday. Bye.